Hello, I'm going to explain how we have used the InfoWiz Toolkit to answer the questions for VEST 2012 Mini Challenge 2. We extensively use the custom written Python scripts to parse the raw data and convert it to format that can be read by the toolkit. And now we're looking at uh, the graph matrix. As you can see, uh, the rows represent uh, the half hour time slices, then the uh, the columns represent uh, source IPs. Colored squares indicate uh, the level of activity of the corresponding IP in the time slice. The darker, the more active. This view reveals many patterns that can be observed in the network. Temporal activity patterns appear as horizontal stripes, while IP-based patterns correspond to vertical stripes. We use a metric for uh, visualization since it does not suffer from visual clutter. With uh, the classical parallel coordinates visualization, we can visualize uh, multi dimensional connection information such as source IP, destination port, classification, and destination IP. And uh, using uh, features provided by IVTK, we can uh, color and uh, label items in uh, and all our dimensions such a way so that uh, they are easier to investigate. So here we see that uh, yellow and red uh, definition ports are mainly used so using the filter we can uh, see that uh, these ones are 139 and 445 and uh, with the help of eccentric labeling we can find out which IPs uh, do establish these connections and uh, which uh, IPs, which workstations do they target. This allows us to further investigate this type of connections. Regular uh, time series display uh, spline curves, each standing for a unique combination of uh, source IP, destination IP and destination port across time. It also allows us to filter data on any of these three dimensions and uh, look for trends and patterns. Here we are looking at uh, the aggregate time series which we developed for the challenge. Each curve uh, represents one uh, source IP and the magic lens uh, allows the user to drill down the data and uh, see which uh, IPs have been connected by the selected IP and on which ports and how many times during the given half hour time slice. IBTK provides uh, good capabilities for filtering, so uh, here we apply filters on the data and can focus on IPs that are of uh, our interest. We have also introduced uh, the ability to rescale the data in order to investigate it easily even when it is very small relative to the overall data set. This uh, visualization gives the overall profile of each particular workstation as source IP or destination IP and we can focus on a specific temporal pattern in activity and uh, it is also much less cluttered than the detailed version of time series. We have developed other tools as well such as Theme River, but for time's sake we haven't covered them in uh, this video.